Hello, Pern fam. Happy Wednesday. Welcome to the other side of the garage. I'm unboxing the new toy, so I thought I'd bring you along for the journey. But this morning, went to BNI again, substituted for one of my old bosses. It was great. Got a business card order out of it, so that's awesome. Might also get a Christmas card order. And I've got an order that I need to use this new toy for. Plus, Bob has like three pending that we need to use it for. So, I thought I'd bring you guys along for another, like, kind of montage. Time lapse thingy. So, let's see if you can guess what it is without me telling you. Power cord, network cable, USB cord. I don't know what else. In case you haven't guessed yet, it's the Uninet Eye Color 600. It is a white toner digital heat transfer printer. Dang it, bro! That was that was my next guess. Couldn't give me a little bit more time, could you? So. Let's try to single-handedly carry it to the other room. I'm not gonna montage this part. It's not gonna be pretty. All right, we got him inside. Get some more crap out of the way here. Remove the packing materials and check the components. Open the front door and the top lid. Uninstall the cartridges to remove the protective film and the USB drive. Install the driver. Only connect the printer when prompted. So now I guess we'll install the software. Okay. Oh, you can't see it. Light balance. First transfer sheet printed. Now, from my research on white toner printers, the printing is not the hard part. It's the marrying of the A, which that's what this is. This is the A sheet with the B sheet. The B is the adhesive. So uh, my customer needed 30 of these super tiny things. Like there's no way I'd be able to like. So the heat press is warming up. Basically the process is you press the bottom platen for 30 seconds. I could buy a heated platen from stalls, but I don't want to. So we'll heat the platen for 30 seconds. Then we'll put this in and it's 120 seconds. And then you're supposed to wipe it down with a cloth for five seconds and then peel it. So they needed 30 of these and I did 45. So hopefully, even if a couple mess up, I'll still have enough. But I'll make my money off of two of them. So as long as for every two that are on here, it pays for this whole sheet. So good money, good money. Okay, so I just finished heating up the bottom platen. So the instructions say put the A down the B with the printed side up. It also says to fold the 
corner here, which you can't see. Hold them this corner up here. Then it says, take a piece of craft paper or Teflon sheet, which I'm gonna use craft paper because my sales guy said he likes it better. And now we're gonna press for 120 seconds, 310 degrees, five pressure, or in this case, it looks like it jumped up to six. So we'll let the time pass. Then we're supposed to rub it with a cloth or textile. So I'm just gonna use an old shirt. All right, got a phone call here in the middle. So you guys didn't get to see it, but you can see that the toner didn't transfer on all of them which I was expecting because they are so tiny. But the nice thing is, is it seems like the majority of them worked. And so I will just basically reference which ones didn't work, which you can see like the whites missing. So I'll reference the ones that are missing and just not use those. And he actually ordered a few more that are three inches. So we'll get another sheet going. So, the first print I did worked fine, but the second print, not so much. I wasted three sheets before I decided to go get some just white, eight and a half by 11. It's stretching it all funny. So, I called and left a message with my salesman, sent him a text, called their support. The support guy had no, no idea. He told me to submit a support ticket and they leave in 12 minutes and they still haven't responded. So I don't think I'm getting this job done today. I'll keep you posted. All right, Prim Fam, I'm gonna call it a night. My customer dropped off all these shirts or jackets. They're actually the safety jackets. They were the ones I was doing the white toter stuff for. Sorry. And initially they wanted two and a quarter. And then they're like, oh, that's too small. Let's do three inches. And then he brought the jackets over and was like, oh, three inches is too small. Make them five inches. And it went from doing 30 pieces to go ahead and do 60 pieces. So it's been a whole mess. Um, he's basically like, charge me whatever you have to do and get them done by tomorrow if you can. So, we'll see. I don't know if I can have them done by tomorrow. We'll probably have to get Bob over here. So, thanks for watching. Make sure you like the video, stay subscribed. Subscribe if you haven't. Leave any comments about whatever, questions, why I have what I have, why I do what I do, etc. If you wanna support the channel, different ways down in the description. And go check out my new website, businesscardsonly.com. Love your feedback. Thanks for editing the videos, Cam. I did not meet my goal. And we'll see you next time. Bye, Prim Fam.